In this video, we showed two tools for electronic signal visualization. One of them involves augmented reality virtual graphs, and the other one involves a pen-sized oscilloscope. All the footage in this video is captured through an augmented reality headset called the Microsoft HoloLens. Here we have a circuit which involves blinking lights. These are controlled by a 555 timer chip, according to a capacitor that's charging and discharging. And the user can either make sounds in order to light up the lights, or they can turn that knob in order to control the frequency at which lights get turned on and off. This is the holographic breadboard. Uh, it's a device that basically takes in an electronic breadboard and it displays virtual signals that the user can see. Uh, the virtual signals are slightly misaligned in this video just because of the way the video is shot. So the user can bring in their own circuit, connect the ground, and then they can connect probes to any part of the circuit in order to visualize the signal that's going on there. So in this case, this is connected to the light that is blinking on the bottom left. And you can see that as the knob is getting turned, the signal is showing according, is changing according to what the light is showing. And then this probe is going to be connected to the capacitor that is controlling the charge and discharge rate. And on the graph on the right side, you will now see that the capacitor is charging and discharging. And on the top graph, you can see the two signals. One is from the light that's blinking, and the other one is from the capacitor that charges and discharges. And this is all interactive, so as, as the user is changing the frequency, you can see the changes in the graphs themselves. <clears throat> so this basically functions like an oscilloscope, except that it's in the user's view, and they just have to look at the circuit in order to understand what's going on. And the issue with this is that, although it's really nice to be able to see all these graphs, it's a little bit complicated to use because somebody has to wear an augmented reality headset, they have to move their circuit to, to place it into this 3D printed enclosure. It's a little bit hard, we found, by testing with students. And so what we invented is a portable version of this, which is basically a handheld oscilloscope. The device measures the same thing. So first you have to connect it to the ground of the circuit, and then you get a little display on it. And so by looking at the display, you can measure the signals in real time. And this is an oscilloscope held in the palm of your hand. And so you can see that as the circuit is being changed, the oscilloscope is measuring the same signal, and it's displaying it on the little display that is held by the user. And now you can see the capacitor charging and discharging and reacting to the changes in frequency dictated by the novel. By creating and researching these kind of tools, we are empowering students to make electronic devices and to understand electronics principles more easily than they could before. And our hope is that these kind of tools will be commonly used in the makerspaces of the future. If you're interested to learn more or to collaborate with us, please feel free to get in touch.